Suprapubic bladder drainage through the abdominal wall is an alternative to transurethral bladder drainage. Cystifix puncture sets are available in different shapes and sizes with either a polyurethane pigtail catheter with its side clamp or a silicone catheter with integrated balloon and a red spigot. Cystifix puncture sets include a metallic splittable puncture cannula with its protective sheath. The set may also include a red catheter stopper or a two liter urine bag depending on the reference. During the preparation phase, fill two syringes, one for anesthetic injection and another for the balloon inflation if a silicone balloon catheter is used. The red spigot or a urine bag is connected to the catheter. The perforation is realized two to three centimeters above the pubic bone in the median line. The bladder must be full with at least 300 milliliters of liquid. The puncture cannot be performed if the bladder is empty. Otherwise, there could be a bowel injury during the perforation. At the start of the procedure, you can anesthetize the targeted area with the needle and the previously prepared syringe. Insert the needle and release the anesthetic solution at several depths. Then, make a small incision with a scalpel on the skin on the target area for easier penetration of the puncture cannula. Cystifix is ready to use as the catheter is pre-inserted into the puncture cannula. The catheter is retracted into the cannula to ensure the adequate distance from the sharp-edged tip. Then, the protective sheath is removed. If the catheter is advanced beyond the puncture cannula bevel, there is a risk of damaging the catheter. Insert the metallic cannula through the skin. Advance under gentle pressure together with the catheter into the bladder. A flow of urine is observed through the catheter's tube. Now, insert the catheter fully through the cannula into the bladder. The catheter may be a balloon catheter, which anchors the catheter inside the bladder, or pigtail catheter, which rolls up inside the bladder. The puncture cannula is retracted from the puncture channel. Once the cannula is completely out of the body, split the cannula by pulling on the wings. The cannula remains attached by the bevel tip. Do not split the cannula if the tip is still inside the abdomen. For the balloon catheter, inflate the balloon with sterile solution. The correct volume is indicated on the funnel-shaped connector. Overinflating the balloon may cause it to burst. Then the catheter is blocked at the upper wall of the bladder by a retraction movement. Finally, connect the catheter to a urine drainage bag. In conclusion, Cystifix puncture sets provide a solution for suprapubic catheterization. Cystifix is available in different shapes and sizes.